Uh, what's up guys, uh, today I'm gonna show you how to partition a model in Abacus. Here you see in this viewport uh, I'm using Abacus 6.13 version and the procedure will be same for uh, even older versions. Uh, if uh, there is any new version also in 14 or 15 the procedure will be I think same. So let's make a new model to start with. I've already set my working directory. Now I'm going to make the part 3D deformable solid extrusion. Uh, let's say 20. Okay, I'll make a triangle or square. Let's make a square. Okay, this is the initial point I've given here the initial point hit enter and the opposite corner now we made the square and here we'll give the depth uh, let's say 0. Point, let's say 0. 0.2 okay so this is the model and model 1 Okay, so this is part one. Suppose I want to partition this part along its mid plane. Here uh, you can uh, go to tools, then partition. So you want to partition either on edge, face, or cell. I want to partition the cell because this is a 3D object, you see. Okay, click here cell. Then there are values, options to partition. What option I am choosing is to define the cutting plane. Okay, if I click here at the bottom, here you can see it will give you three options point and normal, three points, or normal two edges. So I will take three points, then it says select the first point. I select the first point, then second point, then third point, then click here. So now our part one is partitioned into two cells. You can see here two cells. So this is very easy if you are doing horizontal partitions, and it will divide the part into two equal parts. Okay. If I want to partition along the vertical direction, along this direction, not along the mid vertical plane. But at any desired point, if I choose, so you can follow this procedure. There might be some other procedure I don't know, but I know this one and it works. What if I want to partition this part from point one distance from this edge? Uh, let's do it. Select, go to partition. Select edge, cancel out, enter parameter. Okay, choose this edge, choose this edge, this edge, okay, done. Here I'll give you zero point one. Done. Again, uh, let's again select. Okay, let's select these two first. Done. Zero point Now we have partitioned the edge, set the points here on this end 0 0.1 and this end 0 0.1. Okay, the tools partition cell define cutting plane, select the cells to partition done three points. Okay, now see we can choose this point. Can choose this point, can choose this point, create partition. 
see partition this partition this here similarly we can partition along this direction also okay we can cut it plane okay. so. Yeah.